Morning everyone, it's me, it's John Waybreast, I'm like a radio presenter. Uh, yeah, from the Spotted app, and I thought I would do another live, as I just like sometimes like to talk about a few of the things that people have raised over the week. And obviously these are things that people have asking me questions, I think, well, let's tell everyone about it. So I'm massively so passionate about this app, and the few things that have been raised this week, we've got all things that people seem to class as negatives that are going on at the minute and these are all great reasons why I've made the app and why it's here to help. So we've got virus, recession and Brexit. So first of all we've got the virus. I've got my little notes down here. So this is um, this happened a few months ago and it's really really put the spanner in the works for a lot of businesses and been a lot of tough times. So the virus really that's um, I think it's taught us all a lot really about the importance of community and using local businesses and this is one of the main reasons about the app um, I don't let any business promote to get to the top of the list so all businesses are listed by their location so the closest business is at the top so that means that all you can see what businesses are working in your local area and you can really help like your build your local community and what a nice thing to do that knowing you're helping local businesses so that virus has really helped that and we all understand the importance of that now so that's why the app lists business like that so you know that you're seeing businesses in your local area and nothing else um, provides a list like that so we've got the virus which is against us but you know what the app's here to help and that's in in my favor really we've got the recession so we're now officially in a recession and businesses are finding things tough and we have to watch your money. Well, you know what? I'm only charging businesses 99p to list on the directory. How much more, can, it's pretty much free at the end of the day. How much more can I help? You've got the reach of thousands of customers that use the directory for only 99p. Mm -hmm. I had one business once moan to me that it wasn't getting enough work from the app for 99p. It's absolutely beyond, beyond me that I was thinking, hearing that. Um, some people haven't heard any, found anything yet, but you know what? Stay in there. The app's growing massively. You can't, I can't guarantee when someone is going to search service in your area, but you get one job and you've paid for the app for a lifetime. At the end of the day, it's worth the punt. And say so, like the app's growing massive now. It's got really good potential. So just want to talk about that. So yeah, so we've got the importance of community, and so we've got recession. How I'm helping local businesses. I'm really, really passionate about helping local businesses. And then we've also got Brexit which keeps cropping up, that's still happening. And yeah, let's support local communities. Let's keep it all in-house, keep it all in Britain. Um, I'm doing a bit of a marketing ed journey adventure at the minute and looking at my logo and things like that because all I am trying to do is promote and help local businesses. And that's really it. You know, I'm obviously in-house, I'm, I'm made in Britain. And um, yeah, I just want to support that and help that. Can't, cannot help enough. What other things have we got on offer then? That So if, as a customer, how can I find a local business in my area? We've got social media. And yeah, it's great, it's free, but it's long-winded. You know, you have to put a post out there. You have to ask for recommendations. Depends who sees your post. You're waiting for them replies. And you, you just don't know. You, and, and that's normally a load of people saying, use me. And at least with the app, you can instantly go on there. And see who's in your area. It's simple. It's definitely worth having a look on there first straight away. It's free to have a look. And you know why you're using that. You're helping them local businesses in your area. So cool. Yeah, so we've got that. We've also got good old Google. Yeah, it's brilliant. If you've got a business, you can create a website. And within a couple of days, you, you will be listed on Google. But God knows what page you'll be listed on. And at the top of that list, on page one, you've got people with the best website, people who pay the most on SEO. And it isn't about your locality. It's who's being more clever with their website as well. So, yeah, you'll be listed on there, but people have got to search to find you. And again, with the app, you can just see who's working in your area. You could actually type in a different area and you could allo-locate and look at a painter and decorator near your grandma's house, let's say. You know, so there's so much on offer with the app and I'm, all it's about is trying to help the community, local businesses and the consumer. And that's it, you know, and I'm really, really passionate about it. I've learned, I sold the house, I put it all on the line for this, but the more I look into this, the more I realise how much of a need there is for it. 
and there's nothing else out there offering what I've offered. So yeah, so that's it. So if you don't mind, try and spread the word. Um, I'm trying to not sell the app as much anymore. I want people to understand why. And you know, it's, it, I'm almost making a movement. It's just something refreshing, new and exciting and uh, you know, unsupportive. So if anyone's got any ideas, any positive stories, anything like that, share them with me. I will do as much as I can to help anyone where I can. So that's it, just wanted to talk about a couple of things that have been raised, a couple of negative issues that people have got going on at the minute. And you know what, these are all great reasons why we should use the app and to just to try and help local businesses in your area. So thank you very much and I'll do another live, I don't know, whenever next week maybe and talk about some other issues. Um, I've got the upgrade coming out soon so I think that will be coming out next week and we'll talk about that. But yeah, thank you very much for your time and I'll see you again soon.